Hello, welcome back to Dry Creek Beekeeping. Right now, it's actually starting to rain a little bit, which isn't ideal, but today is really my only chance to actually get into my hives and see how they're doing. Specifically, I'm going to be looking at the Alpha Hive. I just recently checked the Beta Hive, so they should be fine, but I haven't checked the Alpha Hive in about three weeks now, so I really want to see how they're doing. So without any further ado, since it's starting to rain a little bit harder, I'm just going to start beekeeping. <laughs> All right, here inside of the beekeeping tent, that rain that's starting shouldn't really be a problem at all. Now there aren't many bees out today, and that's just because of the storm that's coming in. And normally I would not beekeep on days like this, however, as this is my only chance, really, I'm just gonna go ahead and do it. I know the risks that are involved, and it should be fine. Looking at these jars here, the bees have actually drank most of the sugar water out, so that's looking pretty good. And yeah, they are very active under there. What I'm really looking for here today is continued confirmation that the bees are still doing well, they don't have ventilation issues, and the queen is still alive. And speaking of ventilation issues, I can see there is mold starting to grow on the frames here. That's not ideal, because uh, that means that a lot of moisture has been getting in the hive. But on these center frames here, it looks like it's fine. It might just be where the bee cluster is. And it looks like the bee cluster is right over here. They're kind of avoiding this side of the hive. So let's take a look at one of these frames. I'm kind of planning on doing a fairly thorough hive inspection today. And yeah, right now, first impressions look pretty good. You can see there is plenty of brood here. Um, the pattern is pretty sparse, but still for the most part it looks good. And I can see lots of new bees around. Um, in fact, I would say probably one-tenth of the population is new bees now. Yeah, looking good. And looking at the wax on the bottom, it doesn't look like they are making any uh, queen cells, which is also very good. Okay, okay. You see this occasionally as a beekeeper, but it never ceases to be awesome. But right, right there, come on, focus. Yeah, right there, you can see there is a new bee coming out of a cell. How cool is that? I can kind of hear the rain starting to pick up outside. So I'm going to try and make this pretty quick. Also, bees are starting to cover my face. Again, more brood. No queen cells, very good. And lots of new bees. It's a common theme between these frames right now. Continuing the same trend, this frame doesn't have as much brood. Uh, still, same things though. So, w one thing that I'm not seeing in, on, in any of these is any good honey stores. I would like to see those. Oh, all right, all right. I found the honey stores, there they are. Still looking good. Just a little bit dusty from not being used, but still looking good. And it looks like at least five of those frames still have uh, full, if not nearly full, honey stores, and yeah, so it looks like they're doing good. Uh, we did have a very, we did have a cold snap recently, which kind of seems to have set them back a little bit, uh, although there is, there's about the same brood as what I saw uh, three weeks ago, but the number of new bees 
is way higher than what it was. There's lots of bees on the outside of the hive right now, so I'm just gonna kinda scoop them up, put them back inside. Look at all of them. I don't want them to get stuck out here uh, it, since it's turning to night and it's getting a little bit cold and it's starting to rain. Really, I mean, everything is kind of looking good with this hive. I mean, there's not much cause for alarm. In fact, I would say they're doing quite well given the fact that there was that cold snap, though they are very mad today. All right, so to recap what I saw and what I did today, I knew this was kind of going to be a quicker video. I didn't really have much that I was, I kind of really didn't see anything that was too bad. I mean, I did see that mold, but that was expected. And their progress since three weeks ago hasn't gone up too much. However, again, that's not much of a problem. It looks like there's still plenty of new bees, plenty of brood, and honestly, I'm kind of surprised how well they're doing given the fact that we've been enduring a cold snap these past couple weeks. Other than that, really, I mean, I'm sure I will come back to look at my hives in a couple weeks, or depending on how the weather goes, perhaps just one more week, and then I'll check on them again. At this point, the things I'm really watching out for are uh, whether the queen is doing well and whether they are preparing to swarm. Because otherwise, I really don't expect that I'll see anything too wrong with my hives. But anyway, that's the end of this video. Thank you for watching, and if you did enjoy this video, please make sure to leave a like and maybe even subscribe. If you have any questions about beekeeping or just have something to say, feel free to leave a comment and I'll see you guys in the next video.